Okay. Okay. That makes sense. And for the first time two days ago that I try to speak fast. Hey, okay. That's the spirit. Okay. Okay. Well, the thing is, if we actually, well, let's go, well, let's check this out. Okay. So what I like to do, here's my title. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, here goes reason number one right here. Same as studying on campus. No additional expense. Uh, uh, what is it? Be easy, easy to find classes. Take on campus. Now that's basically what I'm looking at here. So again, we got to have our structure at the beginning. So my structure, remember, it's always in my head. Okay. If we look at this, my structure is always in my head. Okay. So I'm going to write that down real quick and show you exactly what that looks like. Okay. Okay. Now this is an announcement. I have one for announcements and I have one for letters. Okay. So, okay, yeah. an announcement made university stating that, now, I'm writing this in red because this is not what I'm going to write down on my paper if I were to take the test, okay? Now, I'm just showing you exactly what's in my head because this is an announcement and I already identified it. I'm going to say an announcement was made by a university stating that. Da, da, da. that's in my head it's already programmed okay. now also i'm going to check this out this is called the charting method i just use two columns and i throw things down now remember i just wanted to quickly show you this part right here because this is the easiest part in terms of breaking everything down okay now okay. in the black writing this is when i start taking down notes from the actual you know the writing and everything so if we look at this right here and I come over here, a lot of my students are like, oh, well, you know, I don't have time. I don't have time. I, I'm writing too much or this or that. And I'm like, hey, you can make up all the excuses you would like to. Okay. But if I can do it, you can do it. Okay. You got to know exactly. I, write, I think I write a lot. To be honest. See, and so the thing is, if you look right here, watch what I do. Three, two, one, timer on. I'm going to write down study abroad semester okay over here i'm going to write the two reasons now reason number one the cost semester uh what is it cost is the same no additional expense cost is the same no additional expense you know i just realized this is a letter by the uh -huh. way whoops <laughs> and then easy to find the same classes 40 seconds boom i just realized it is in fact a letter and it says yeah, that's what i was gonna say this is what i tell me yeah <laughs> it's a letter yeah so, so here we go so let me write that down then what i'm gonna say here a letter written student by student government suggesting that there goes my letter that's it that's how i'm gonna do with my letter same shit that's what i'm gonna do and i wrote down a couple of things so this is what it looks like so how would it sound like a letter was written by a student suggesting that students should study abroad for one semester oh let me say that again that students should study abroad for one semester i just added that shit in does it matter no fuck indians <laughs> Okay, because I'm going to say whatever the fuck I want to say, and I'm going to get a high school. Remember, you're not being graded on the content. You're being analyzed in your speech. That's all they do. If you get a low score, it's because the Indians got you. The scammers got you. Okay, got to make sure we do them at university. So with that being said, I put the title in. Let me do that again. A letter was written by a student suggesting students to study abroad for one semester because of what? Well, because, and this is why it's very important to write with intent, because the cost is the same. You see how easy it was to say because, and then because the cost, the subject of my first reason is cost. Cost is what? The same, and there are no additional expenses, as well as it would be easy, and let me let me see how I'm going to break this down. It would be and then right there come to the easy 
it would be easy to find the same classes at the university as it would be here. I just made that up. Let's do the whole thing. Let's do the whole thing now. Check this out. Three, two, one. A letter was written by a student suggesting that the university should allow students to study abroad for one semester because the cost is pretty much the same here on campus and there would be no additional expenses. As well, it would be easy to find the same classes at the university as they have here. 17.72. I just made all that up. Your biggest thing, to be honest with you, is the connecting language you use. It's all about that connecting language. All about that connecting language. Now, you saw how I was able to just bullshit and go and go and go and go. I only wrote down a couple of things just like you. I only wrote down a couple of things just like you, okay? But the thing is, I'm able to carry my bullshit and keep going and going and going. I take that test, the motherfucking Indians better give me a goddamn 30 or I'm going down there and I'm kicking 1.3 billion motherfuckers in their head. Okay, you understand what I'm saying? So this is what we got to get yes, done. How we got to get down, okay? Okay. Ah, okay, with that being said, <laughs> kicking 1.3 billion my leg would hurt so much okay so does that make i know i am so violent don't worry i'm a lover not a fighter okay so a letter was again so that's my format i wrote down the red just to show you my connectors and stuff like that now you're probably gonna ask me hey arsenio so uh what do you use to connect the next part okay here we go a man or <laughs> a man <laughs> the man or woman agrees or disagrees because that's my structure in my head that is my structure in my head i'm gonna do that no matter what all the way through does that make sense yes so now what i have to do i'm gonna have to break it down a way where i'm gonna take notes you're gonna see how i do this Okay, are you excited? Are you ready for this? I'm excited too. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna press play and then we're gonna go. Well, I'm gonna go and you're gonna see how I do this. And then you're gonna practice. But just to stop right there, what do you think? Do you think, uh, like, is this very similar to what you do? Yes, it is. Okay, okay. So what's gonna be your biggest challenge? I'm guessing it's only the connecting language to connect everything and making sure you write with intent in terms of knowing what you're going to say in each line, suggesting this, suggesting that they should study abroad for the semester because there would be no additional costs as it is the same or something like that. Knowing exactly how you're going to connect each line of notes. That's your biggest thing. Okay. Yes. All right. So I don't even know which one I did. I think I did Portland. Let me go grab this. Uh, I'm going to press the, you're going to watch me take notes right now and you're going to love it. Okay, here we go. I'm going to take notes. Watch my magic again. Not going to write down that much, but I'm going to write down with intent. Let's go. So what do you think about the letter? Well, a study abroad semester might sound like a good idea, but I really don't think making it mandatory is the right decision. So you don't agree with it? No. The letter writer says that the expenses would be the same as the program fee in the foreign university will be the same as our tuition fee. Yes. It's obvious that they're not seeing the whole picture. What about the plane tickets and transportation costs? Considering these out-of-pocket expenses, it will definitely cost more than our regular college tuition. But it's only going to be for one semester. I'm sure a lot of students would go for it. I really doubt it. Besides. How can he be so sure the courses in foreign schools are the same as ours? Yeah, that might pose a problem. Remember my friend Peter? Last year, he went abroad for a semester. His university did not recognize one of the courses he took there, as the content was very different. He then had to retake the course back at his university. Oh, no. That sounds bad. Uh-huh. Well, that's basically what I got down. That's what I have down right there. So what am I going to do? I'm going to say, well, the man disagrees because it wouldn't be the right decision to make because the expenses do and may sound like they are the same. 
but it's obvious that he's not seeing the entire picture in regards to the additional plane tickets, transportation costs, and the burdening of everything else that they would have to go through in that specific country, resulting in it being too much. Also, the courses are just not going to be the same because he had a friend last semester by the name of Peter, and that university that he was actually studying at in the foreign country did not recognize the courses from his home country. So what he had to do is when he came back from France back to the United States, he had to retake all the, cl the classes again because it wasn't recognized. So these are the two reasons to why the man disagrees with the letter writer in regards to the decision of going through or suggesting that people should study abroad for a semester. That's my emergency conclusion if I need to do it. That's my breakdown. I made up a lot of shit, didn't I? I made up a lot of shit. I wrote my little, my structure right there in that black. I You didn't see, I didn't try writing everything. Yes, I did miss a lot of things, but I remembered a lot of things too. This is what you got to do. And so I don't know how much different it is from you. What do you think? I think I do um, similar this one, like you, honestly. Okay. Very similar. You're better, of course, but but I have the same base. Okay, it's not okay. So obviously, okay, better, whatever. That's all good. But at the same time, let's. What did I do in my speech or my note taking that if you were to implement it, it would make it easier for you? There we go. That's how we grow. What did I do in my note taking? Or what did I do in my speech that, hmm, I heard you say this. Let me try implementing that because it would allow me to do this. It could help me with this. See what I mean? I like how you wrote because. Okay. Oh, so you're writing the full word. Yes, I am. <laughs> Never write the full word. You see over here, let's go check out these notes. Now, yeah, there were times that I wrote the full notes. There are some times that I'm just hurrying up and rushing and trying to get shit down and it could get real crazy. Absolutamente. Okay, but what we have to do is, here we go. I didn't write down picture here. I write down, I, I was just going to write down trans, <laughs> but considering America's going to shit right now, they just hate everywhere. Okay, so fuck it. On the paper, I'm going to write trans. I don't give a shit. Okay, so there we go. Courses, not saying because. Peter, last year, rec recognize here. Yeah, actually, I kind of write the full words too, huh? Don't I? But to be honest with you, if you're writing the full word, not good at all. But remember, I'm taking my time with my notes because I know and I'm trusting my ability that what I am writing are the big main ideas and I could make up all the other bullshit to fulfill it. So that's why I'm writing down the full word because this is all I need and I'm going to make up all the other bullshit and put it all together later. Ding, ding, ding. Eh, eh. Eh, eh. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> You're like, 